episode of Smoking with X. Uh, today, um, y'all might not recognize the man, but you might recognize his voice. Um, this man sitting to my left, he is responsible for the funniest content I be seeing on my Instagram. You know what I mean? Up and down my timeline, we got the main man from Vault. I'm going to let you introduce yourself a little more uh, direct, though, to the people, man, so we could uh, really get a feel for your vibe, bro. So tell the people who you are and, you know, what Vault is. My name is Vault Rob. Well, that's what people call me anyway. You can call me Rob, Vault Rob. Just don't call me late for dinner. You <laughs> feel me? Uh, the Vault is really, like, everything. You feel me? Whatever you can, whatever I can get in that motherfucker is what the vault is. Honestly, bro, I'm really uh, trying to turn that bitch into the old world star because the new one's whack. You know hey, what I'm saying? Preach, uh, preach, bro. Uh, preach. I'm not, I'm not dissing nobody or nothing like that. You feel me? But I just, uh, I just don't be seeing the same content as I used to. And That's let me all that let is. me tell you why because they went under uh, quite different managements. At one point, my, one of my favorite YouTubers, uh, it's real eighty five. He was. Over at World Star, and I feel like that's when they had some funny ass shit. Because let me tell you, this Don't nigga is. Not. Yeah, I know. Yeah, but they buddy. they go so, not to get too sidetracked from that um, fucking um. Something to talk about. Yeah, nah. So when that when uh he was over there, man, uh, that shit definitely there was some funny shit. But uh, nah, man. So, Vault Rob, I've never heard that name. So. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I make, I do interviews. I make clothes. I do a lot of shit, bro. Sometimes. Which, who sometimes. you rocking right now, man? Because I kind of seen the logo oh, on the back. Oh, I, a, you ain't gotta, you ain't gotta stand up too much, but okay. This is a big city sound vibe right here. Yes. I would show y'all the back, but it's it's a lot going on. It's a lot going on, but shout out to the city sound. Shout out city do. sound posse. You know what I'm saying? That's home team. Oh God, it's regular activities over there though. Uh, they just be trying to make a dream happen, and and, and it happen every day over there. I swear it do, bro. Hell it's yeah, crazy. Man. So uh. What got you into um, really in the social media realm? Because, like, no one just up and says, I'm going to start making merch and I'm going to have a media page and just post the funniest shit. So does, you know, the, the decline <laughs> in World Star's content kind of have a lot to do with that? Uh, No, really. Like, I started to merch shit when I was working at this place called Artisan. Artisan, okay. Yeah, it's a little uh, weed spot distribution center and shit. Um. I was sitting there thinking, like, this is cool and all, but I definitely don't want to work for anybody anymore. I'd rather do my own shit. And then I seen that a heat press was $200 on Amazon. Hell yeah. And I'm like, oh, yeah, I can make some money off of that. And then that's why I started making <clears throat> the merch and shit. But, like, the media, like, came later, for real, for real, because I had... I had made the Vault Merch official Instagram, and I was just rocking on there, and I was posting fights and all type of dumb ass shit on that motherfucker, but then I started getting reported a lot, right. and I'm like, all right, I guess I got to stick to Strictly Merch on this one, and then I made another one that was like a, it was like another merch Instagram, and I'm like, this ain't going to be a move, you feel me? So I just turned it to Vault Official News, and then that's where I'm like, oh yeah, I could just post all the fights, and then do some promos for rappers and shit, get it like right, some real right. views. And I seen that uh, with part of your promo package. Uh, shouts out to the homie, basically my best friend. I, I don't even want to be basically in front of it, but uh, the sixty dollar part of your promo package. Mm -hmm. The homie twerks to your uh, song and everything. Shouts yes, out sir. to that. Y'all got any people biting that yet, or? Uh, you know, not yet, but you know, it's in the works. It'll happen. It'll Facts happen, was. for sure. Hell yeah. You know, people like to see that ass shaking. Man. <laughs> that type of shit. I, I'm gonna be real. I kind of don't like it, but I kind of do. I mean, you heard you, you kind of do. You know what I mean? Yeah, but it, it's more so like if we in the, if we in a room type shit, that's Yeah, I, yeah, I that's cool. Like that's people. cool. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I get it, bro. Because yeah. Instagram is definitely flooded. So, uh, you know. You kind of got into, you know, you do merch and the uh, social media thing. Besides that, what else do you do? Like, are you in, into any other hobbies? Uh, smoke a lot of weed, really. I'm trying to pick up, like, uh, the camera. I've been doing a lot of uh, BTS with my nigga Josh Jordan. Shout out to Josh. Oh, God. I've been doing a, a lot of BTS. I've been popping up with him to the music videos and shit. And uh, really just trying to work the camera, honestly. Like, I'm, I'm trying to do everything. I'm... Really about to get in the booth and uh, figure out some engineer shit. I Man, might hop that. on that motherfucker and rap. Who knows? Like, I might just pick up I'm everything. I'm going to tell you now, do not hop in on that bullshit. 
Oh yeah, I'm, rapping, I'm hopping in. I'm I'm hopping in on that bullshit, boy. Fact. To each his First own. thing I'm doing <laughs> is bullshit. Yeah, yeah. How long you been in Sacramento? Most of your life? All your life? Uh, I was born out in Washington, and okay. I moved to Tacoma. I moved out here when I was like eight, and after that, I just been stuck. You feel me? Oh yeah. How was out in Tacoma? Uh, hectic, but you know we made the best of what we had and shit. Honestly, uh, I. I was so young, I didn't really know what was going on at the time, you know what I mean? Like, I seen shit, like, I still remember wild-ass cowboy shit. We didn't have lights, no water, like, it, real, that real, type of real crazy ca cowboy shit, you feel me? But, I fucks with that type of lifestyle. Like, you know? <laughs> yeah, that's that's what makes a nigga what he is, honestly. But uh, it was definitely times where niggas was really living cool. Like, OG right. did her thing, and she 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 brought me up right to where I'm, I know what the fuck Shouts I'm supposed out. to do. Oh, God. Facts with both of them. Shout out OGs, you feel me? He <laughs> said OGs. You ain't gonna say mom and pops is OGs. Nah, I, I ain't got no pops. Uh, it's both my moms. Uh, respect, respect, mm -hmm. respect. Yeah, I don't know what the fuck that nigga doing. But <laughs> we ain't even gonna talk about milk, it. Milk, cigarettes, never came back. <laughs> I'm gonna uh, get a pack of posts real yeah, quick. Somebody I don't know. smoked my last one. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Factuals, bro. Hey, that type of shit. So, I got a, a, little, a little weird question to you. We can get back to the... You know what? We gonna, we gonna stay with the, the structural shit a little bit. Top five rappers, bro. Uh, top five. That's solid. Mm. Top five. God damn, bro. Can I give you like a top three, maybe? That's cool. I'm gonna have to say. I know people are gonna judge me, but I'm gonna have to say Drake, cause I feel like Drake really uh was a real part of my life growing up, for real, for real. I feel it. Hey, I'm not. He definitely had hella bangers, you feel me? Like, you can't knock that. Yeah, I can't knock that. You can't that. knock that. Nobody you know can saying? knock no, that. Nobody can knock nobody that. Nobody can knock that, bro. Factuals, but not even, like, on some real, like, just on some regular shit, you feel me? Like, shit I wanted to be a part of. So who? I couldn't even yeah, get So who's following it. Drake up? I got to hear uh, this one. Let's see. I'm going to have to go with Pac for show, for show, because that's a hitter. Hold that's on, dog. locked in. Hold on, my nigga. But, nah, Hold nah, on. nah, it's not in order. It's oh, order. I was no, about no, to no, say no, never, what? Never will that be the order. I can't do an order, bro. There's no, like, I, there's really no favorite for me, you feel me? Like, I can't do favorite anything, honestly. Like, I feel I, that. I, I just I have, that. my ear for music is wild. Like, I, I, I just can't zone in on one thing to be my favorite. But what, I'd say what I listen to the most is, like, that type of shit, you feel me? Nah, uh, for sure. I can't even give you a third one, honestly, bro. You ain't, got like, no, you ain't got no Uzi on your list? Nah, no, I don't right, respect, Uzi respect, like that. respect. Yeah. Respect. <laughs> I, I was a test. I was a test. Yeah, I don't know. I, I'm cool off the shoulder movements. And yeah, now I do what I want. That's cool. Do your thing, bro. But uh, I'm not a big Uzi fan. So you yeah. can't come up with not a third, just Pac and Drake. Uh, I mean, those are two diverse, different Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. Factual, ball bro. Ball for sure. Uh, sugar free. Okay. Respect. Yeah, Fucking sugar respect. Free. Fucking yeah. respect. I, I respect that. Sugar free, most definitely. Can I can I rearrange that order for you? Pac, sugar free, Drake. Uh, for sure. The, yeah, that's, that, uh, that's a respectable. Up. But you just had me thinking off the top of my head, bro. No, nah, I feel you. I so feel I, you. I, I I couldn't put nobody in order. All right. So that's definitely not the. You feel me? Drake's right. definitely not number one. Right, nah, or none of that extra nice ass shit. Nah, nah, nah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, what? Who's one rapper that you like that people hate? Like one for me that I like that people really don't fuck with is Nicholas F. A lot of people, because he does this thing with his audio where it's just like real raw audio. And like a lot of people can't fuck with that, but his bars are there, bro. And his lyricism is like impeccable, bro. I'm not saying he's the best rapper, but his bar, bro, like the nigga is fucking dope, bro. I got to listen to some shit. Uh, a rapper that I like that people hate. Uh, maybe Hobson. Oh yeah, you are a Hobson fan. I f I'm not I'm not a fan, but I fuck with the nigga music. Like mm. it's it's definitely different. So, like I said, my ear for music is like so you got, outside the box. So do you so. fuck with Tech Nine? Yeah, uh, I fuck with Tech Nine for sure, for sure. Uh, we gotta cut the interview short. Uh, <laughs> my bad, bro. My bad, G. That's just what I, I listen to music. No, know, so man? yeah, I and I get that. You. Hmm. <laughs> What do you want from me, bro? What's wrong with Tech Nine? What's wrong with Tech Nine? 
I can explain. I, okay. I'm gonna do a, a right. one minute rundown of Damn my it. feeling of what Tech Nine is. I'm been prepared for this. All right. Been ready for this. Let's start <laughs> with I will I will give him his props for starting a style that actually lasted and stayed, and other people caught on to it and you know ran with it. I respect him for that. But what I don't really fuck with Tech Nine is, bro, you can play an old Tech Nine song, and this is me being a person who don't fuck with him, and I've listened to his music from the past and at the time and then some of his newer shit because i had to re retouch back because you know people kept like oh you're tripping i'm like i'm no i know i'm not tripping mm -hmm. i couldn't tell you if you played all three songs i couldn't tell you which one was the old one which one was it's the one new, from i get the it new or I like it. so it's like i get it at some point in time bro you got to step, step out your comfort yeah, zone and this up. is me only being in the rap game for like seven years saying that facts and another thing is to chop, chop, chop. What the <laughs> fuck, nigga? Come on, bro. Come on, my nigga. Come on, bro. Yeah, I switch it up, bro. Yeah. And hey, one more Tech thing. Nine, if you listen to this, switch that shit the fuck up, G. And one more thing. I stand behind that. There's somebody I know that he did dirty, but I ain't going to talk oh, okay. about that. Yeah, yet. we won't even bring that one yeah, up. Yeah, I ain't going to bring that one. He you was out here saying? doing his thing, you know, living Wild. the streets of Sacramento. Nutso. Legit, the streets of Sacramento. Would you fuck with somebody who's two feet taller than you? Oh, shit. Really I really think about this. I bet you it's like seven nine. Cause I'm I'm five nine myself. I mean, I'm a short guy or whatever, average height. So it's, I'm average. six three, so that means that would be eight three. Average seven nine, bro. <laughs> yeah, factuals. I mean, I'm gonna be real. I'm fucking with it. Seven nine. Is she a baddie though? Obviously, she gotta be a baddie if Obviously. you're seven nine. You feel me? Like, yeah, I fuck with it. I'm not tripping. What about y'all? Well, I'm asking the room for this one. What about you niggas? How y'all feel? You would? Fuck it. 7-9? Batty? Buns on her, you feel me? Oh, whoa. Going to town on the titties. And I'm saying she got the knockers, slappers. Boom, boom, boom. Sheesh. 7-9, bro. Real Amazonian. Godly. I'll fuck it with that. For the See, you about to get me in trouble. I got a shorty. She about to listen to this shit, and I'm about to get My all bad, types bro. of caught up. Hey, yeah, quit asking hey, me this kind of crazy I, shit. Hey, I didn't tell you to go all into okay, depth. Yeah, I didn't right. tell you, you did. to go to depth. You, didn't. Yes, you so. didn't. Who's your Who's your favorite comedian, bro? If you had to like, or any Instagram influencer that you see that's hella funny. Favorite comedian. Or your favorite Instagram page. All three of those. Like the, uh, for the memes and shit. I'm gonna actually do a top three real quick. You don't got to do the top three. I'm throwing you in there. Yep. Fuck him. I appreciate uh, that. The food community, they be having me weak as fuck. Oh, the food community be having some shit. They be I just like, can't, you know. Man. They got watermarks and shit like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, for real. And then <laughs> fucking, um, bruh, what's the, ah, uh, what's bruh's page? Um, he just be posting the most fucked up shit. Uh, shit, shit, shit. I can't remember his name off the top, but, bro, the memes I be getting. We looking on on there. I'll be sending some fucked up shit to the homies, but they be, be on like, this, nigga, uh, what the fuck? <laughs> website called Fly Height. Fly Height, okay. Yeah, they Put be having on. some. They be having some crazy ass niggas be getting. So that's why I got the video earlier, nigga getting slammed, boy. They took that shit down off of Instagram. Uh, they took that shit down off of Instagram so quick. I'm like, fuck. I guess I gotta post another video now. And all uh, them weird ass websites that the dark shit. Yeah, they had that best gore. Yeah, and best yeah. gore. Yeah. Yeah, I, I was watching that. Yeah, I'm not gonna uh, yeah. lie. Well, Niggas is getting fucked up on there, G. Let me tell but, you how I knew. You walked in here with Swishers, my nigga. That's hey, how I knew you was a part of that game. I smoke Swishers, bro. I'm not gonna lie. Let, let's talk about that for a second. I mean, every, nah, that's just me, bro. Right? That's just me, for real, for real. Like, I, I said this. I don't know early. what niggas do out in Washington, G. I'm mm -hmm. not even gonna lie to you. I've been in Sacramento so long. I don't know what the fuck they got going on out there. Like, they brand new key addition to me. If you're not smoking the diamond or the regulars, you really is on some other shit. You uh, already on some other shit, smoking mm, swishers. But this is a me thing, for real, for real. Uh, uh, niggas be dissing like a motherfucker, though, boy. Like, everywhere I go, like, y'all talking shit right now. Nah. <laughs> oh, yeah, okay. Let me, this, let me tell you, the people I've This is a me seeing, thing, right? I think, I think. <laughs> Hold on. Everybody okay. on the show knows I only smoke raw papers. Let me, let me get out my babies, boy. I only fuck with these. I only smoke these. I mean. Mm, man. Raw, come fuck with you, boy. I fuck with you, man. But I'm yeah. not mad at whatever's in the air as long as the weed is good, all right? I'm not one of them niggas like, oh, I only smoke a Swisher or only smoke Backwoods. I, I smoke everything. I'm a really I used to be me. that way. 
I'm a real big fan of Mookie's. For people who don't know what that is, that's, yeah, tobacco with the weed. And a bowl. And, and a bowl, yeah. Big bong activities. That's what I'm on, bro. I gotta talk about the salad, bro. Everybody I know mean, I eat the dry salad. It's yeah, good. Yeah, I eat the dry salad. Hold on, 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 hold on. Oh, what's the we, weird We gotta talk about like? some food real quick because, you, yeah, you kind of had me out there and people was really getting on my line. You're saying, but what Food-wise, would you like for food? I'm gonna be real. If I'm gonna be filming and we doing something, I'm gonna have to eat right. So, you know, I'm gonna probably get like a salad, water. I'm and like, you know what's crazy? I hate ranch. I hate ranch. What is wrong with you? Bro, well, hey, my, uh, shout out to my you sister. You never for, ate pizza before? You blue I do. Guy, huh? No, I hate blue cheese too. Okay. I cannot stand that. I just, you know, I just eat my shit dry, bro. Bro, a dry <laughs> ass salad? So you Fuck, know. Fuck, bless you, bro. <laughs> my bad. Nah, it's, I'm, I, I, I was ready for it. I was ready. I'm, I like it. I mean, me too, bro. I'm not gonna hold. Uh, I stand behind what I'm about to say right now, and I'm pretty sure a lot of people gonna go against what the fuck I got going on. Go ahead, say it. Shout out my granny for really putting me on this one. Uh, peanut butter or pickle sandwich? Oh, nigga. Yeah. Yeah, oh, yeah. nigga, that is different. I know, I know, I know. Everybody yes. gonna go, oh, yeah, that nigga weird. I am oh. weird, bro. I eat a peanut butter pickle sandwich. Yeah, yeah. shout out Granny RP. You like that? Regular activities. Nah, boy, I was, that taste look, ain't gonna mix, fam. I was, I grew up around a lot of women, you feel me? Pregnant, all the extra nice so ass shit. So they just did weird. So, yeah, yeah. everything yeah. was weird. Everything was wild, bro. I want to yeah. give a, a quick shout out to that boy, uh, Godfrey. He should be sponsored by Sriracha. He actually be finishing them bottles. He don't be throwing them hoes away. Big Sriracha guy. Yeah, he's a sir. He puts Sriracha on everything. Sriracha on popcorn. Sriracha oh, on yeah. cereal and milk. Sriracha Whoa. on Oreos. Sriracha. Hey, bro, don't <laughs> dub my nigga out like that, bro. <laughs> he be putting cereal and milk Sriracha. That's not even weird though, bro. I mean, it is kind of weird, bro. How is it? Okay, can we explain? Can we get a definition on how that's weird, Nick? Because. Why are you just eating dry ass out? Bro, back then when there wasn't no vinaigrette, when there wasn't no I fucking mean, ranch not, niggas hey, was eating. Hey, 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 wait, 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 wait. What year are we in now? We in 2021. Oh, okay. They have ranch. They All got, that nasty shit. Yeah. They have vinaigrettes. They got. It, they no. have a, they have a, a very wide selection of dressings. Ranch stinks and it tastes nasty. There's no need for you to eat any vegetable dry. If Anything. you if you eat ranch, Not I just enough. assume your breath stink. God, bro, <laughs> man. You're no, okay, a no, no, no. Okay, I'm, I'm fucking with you, but this is real. If you eat uh, salt and vinegar chips, I cannot fuck. Don't talk to me. Don't talk to me. Damn, After eating them shits, just wait, wait until you drink something. Do not come, cause that is the worst fucking smell. Is them salt and vinegar chips on somebody's breath, bro? <laughs> that is the worst fucking smell. Yeah, the uh, French onion is bad. I get that. Oh. I fuck with the French onion, but that salt and vinegar hit different. Yeah. But yeah, man, uh, I want you to uh, let the people know where they can find your um, social information. If they want to get merch from you, where they can find the all that information. Just let the people know, man. Vault Merch Official is where you can go tap in for the merch on Instagram. You feel me? Vault Official News is where you can go tap in. For all right, and that's been the end of the podcast. <laughs> oh, yeah, we out of here. I'm, right? I'm, fucking with you, not I'm about to smoke this Swisher uh, and we're nah, gone. Nah, but oh, no, 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 no. Uh, Vault Official News <laughs> is where you go see the bullshit and uh, I don't know, really just get lost in the Instagram, bro. For real, for real. Like, go enjoy that motherfucker because I feel like I be putting a lot of work in that bitch. I enjoy doing it and. I feel like I really hope everybody enjoys watching this shit, even though I be, don't be posting no positive or nothing major like that. Man. Yeah, hey, it'd be a lot of bullshit. I'd be nah, posting, it's funny, though. And also, I want to say, uh, also go check out. Again. Yeah, you good. Also, go check out the interviews he does on oh, uh, yeah, City Sound. Oh, yeah, big interviews. Uh, City Sound Sack. Yeah, City Sound Sack on uh, YouTube. YouTube. He's, Factuals. That, and that's what I meant earlier at the beginning of the podcast. The voice, you're going to recognize it because that is the man behind the mic for the vault interviews. Yeah, you might have heard a couple of interviews. Maybe one or two. And if you haven't, go check out every single one because yeah, there are, yes, you, there's, I'm telling you, there's a lot to learn from these people. And mm-hmm. I, even though I had one, I'm not saying that because I had one. I'm just saying I watched every single one and I learned something goats. about every artist that was on there. Everybody who's know. doing interviews, goats, bro. I swear. It's, it's crazy. Everybody's goats. And I'm sitting on so many. I, it's crazy that I'm dropping them every Monday. I feel like I'm not dropping them soon enough because I'm sitting on. Keep so that many. pace. Keep that I know, pace because I know I gotta keep the people waiting. Nah, that and because it's like I know. Okay, Monday I'm checking out my ADD shit and I check out y'all yep. and then I check out if if it's real dropped anything. Oh, all deaf digital. Yeah. 
All WF. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They be doing their uh, squad cast shit every uh, Mondays and shit. But other than that, man, yeah, uh, this has been Smoking With X. You know, we always talk about that real shit. Yes, sir. We out.